a party that is excusing their own bigotry and anti-Semitism, a party that is pushing the most radical socialist economic policies that will guarantee America spirals into a depression. It's that serious. A party that has gone so far to the left, they won't even hold a debate on the Fox News channel. By the way, I won't be hosting. Don't worry. Let not your hearts be troubled. A pretty gutless move by Democrats. And yesterday, President Trump, he responded on Twitter, writing, quote, Democrat, just Democrats just blocked at Fox News from holding a debate. Good. And I think I'll do the same with the fake news networks and the radical left Democrats in the general election debates. Well, that makes sense, given that every single second of every 24 hour day, these other networks are totally, completely dedicated to one thing and one thing only, trashing, smearing, besmirching and destroying President Trump and anyone that likes him. And I'm sure these networks would love to hold future Republican debates, despite, of course, constantly dehumanizing and lying about President Trump and never admitting it. In reality, we know that 2020 Democrats, they're just too afraid to face real questions from fair and balanced journalists here on the Fox News Channel and our news division. Journalists who don't buy into the conspiracy theories and fake news that will ask fair and tough questions. You know what? They're not in the tank like CNN and MSNBC. On this network, we distinguish opinion and news. Obviously, I am a talk show host, and I've explained that job for all the people that want to listen. They don't seem to understand what it is we do. Journalists who won't feed questions to their favorite candidates ahead of time. Remember, CNN did that for Hillary Clinton. Remember in 2016, Hillary Clinton's campaign totally ignored huge blocks of voters that she considered deplorable. The rest is history. Maybe this radical crop of 2020 Democrats Maybe they'll learn from her mistakes. I tend to doubt it. Okay, tonight, before we get to our guests, we have an important update. Hannity, 